Hello once again guys, I hope you're good and welcome back to another video. So I've got a new series for you today. We all love to do the long career modes, the proper road to glory styles, starting as a one star team in the hopes that one day we'll be bringing them to the Champions League final. So why not give you guys the top 10 players for each position that you can get for under 1 million. So that's where we begin today, with the striker position. So let's get straight into it. So we begin with an English 17 year old, Ben Brereton of Nottingham Forest. 6 foot, 59 rated and has some decent pace and physical stats to go along with that. As you should expect, the majority of his technical stats are terrible and it's a similar story throughout this top 10. But when you're spending less than 1 million, you should be able to accept this. High medium work rates, 3 star weak foot, 2 star skills and a potential of 78. If he's the right choice for you, then he's going to be costing about 400k and 2300 a week. Next up is a Colombian, Michael Gomez. Evergado is his team and I haven't heard of them in my life, so welcome to the channel, Evergado. As for Michael, 19 years old, 5 foot 11, 61 rated, similar to Brereton, good pace and that's about it really. 69 jumping, 68 balance, 65 finishing and 64 attack positioning, it's pretty good considering his rating. High medium, 3 star, 2 star and a potential of 78 to reach. He's going to be costing 700k and just 850 a week. Coming in 8th is one of many of Olympic Lyon's young prospects this year, Maizian Molida. French, just 17 years old, 5 foot 11 and 55 rated in the first season. 88 balance is pretty incredible for his ridiculously low rating and he's got 78 agility too. Medium, medium, 4 star, 3 star and a potential of 78. A good option if you're looking for someone who's better with his feet and beating his man with his close control. If that's the way you play best, well, he'll be costing you a whopping 300,000 and 2,800 a week. Think you can afford that? In 7th is Derby County's Mason Bennett, one of the highest rated of today's top 10 at 63 rated. 20 years old, 5 foot 10, 84 acceleration, 80 jumping, 78 sprint speed and 71 agility. Medium, medium, 3 star, 3 star and a potential of 78. As I said, one of the more established players, even then, could definitely do with training. If you want him, 850k is the cost and 7,200 a week is his current wage. Our next player is Sebastian Pedersen of Norway. 56 rated, 17 years old, it's what we've come to expect now. Someone who's going to be needing a lot of work, not hopeless though. He's got some relatively good pace and balance. Medium, medium work rates, 3 star weak foot, 2 star skills and a potential of 79 to aim for. If you feel like spamming this Norwegian through the training process, then 300k and 850 a week is all you're going to be needing to pay. Coming in at the halfway point is our third Englishman, it's Ethan Jones of Shrewsbury. So of all the players so far, Ethan captures my attention the most. It may or may not be something to do with that 87 acceleration and 86 sprint speed. I haven't quite figured it out yet. He's 18 years old, 57 rated, 5 foot 11 and his pace combined with his not so average strength and agility, he'll be a great player at a lower level. High medium work rates, 3 star, 2 star and a potential of 79. Of all the players so far, Ethan's my preferred choice, at a cost of 350k and 850 a week. Just behind the top three, Maximiliano Romero. So he's got an inquiry price of 1 million, which pretty much assures the fact that you can get him for less than 1 million. 17 years old, 63 rated, 5 foot 10, 82 jumping, 76 sprint speed, 74 acceleration, 68 agility, 67 strength and 66 finishing. Medium low, 3 star, 2 star and a potential of 79. A monster of a player to get into your squad, so best not to miss out on him now while he's going for 1 million and 1,700 a week. Making it into the bronze medal position is Sunderland's Joel Osorro. The only player of today to come from a Premier League side, but a very special player indeed. 17 years old, Swedish, 63 rated, 89 acceleration, 87 sprint speed, 78 balance, 74 agility, 73 dribbling and 66 shot power. Medium, medium, 3 star, 3 star and a potential of 80. An amazing pacey option up front. Him and Ethan would be an interesting partnership. Osoro is valued by Sunderland at 1 million and he's on 3,900 a week. So if you want him, best hurry up and get that deal sorted. Second is Dylan Vente of Feyenoord. 
a new player added into the game and he's automatically become one of the best strikers to get for under 1 million. 17 years old, 62 rated, 5 foot 11. 83 jumping, 77 agility and 74 acceleration. High medium, 4 star, 2 star and a potential of 81. Like all the players, it would be best to get him straight into the training sessions. But for 850k and 1,900 a week, this guy is an incredible purchase. But getting the number one spot in this one is Wolfsburg's Nigerian striker. It's Victor Osman. An absolute beast of a player to get for any League One side. It's strange. Sometimes Wolfsburg say that he's not available because he's recently joined the club. Other times they don't. So that's just a pre-warning if you can't get him. 17 years old, 6 foot 1, 62 rated. Good speed, jumping and strength. An incredible framework to become an extremely potent goal scorer in the future. Medium, medium, 4 star, 3 star and a potential of 84. So Wolfsburg are happy to see him leave for 975,000 and he'll accept 5,400 a week. So if you want the best striker for under 1 million, best to snap him up quickly. So that's the top 10 strikers for under 1 million. Victor does look incredible, but if you can't get him, there are good alternatives too. Hopefully this video is a massive help to those who need these sort of players, but that's this video done. If you like the video, be sure to let me know by pressing that like button. Stay subscribed for plenty more top 10s, 20s, 25s and other career mode videos. And I brace for impact and thanks for watching.